Welcome back, everyone. It is time for a game of pressure points. This is movie related. So basically, we'll have six choices up here, and we're going to have to narrow it down to three that all have something in common. I. Yes. So. It's been a while because my memory is terrible. Why is the word pressure in it? I don't yeah, know. that's the pressure. I don't know. The pressure okay, let's in look it. at it. Highest grossing movies of 2023. Oh, I'm yeah, sure yeah, Jen yeah. John Meyer will get this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One. Well, I, I know at least three of them. So we got almost an order here. Well, maybe not Barbie, Super Mario, Oppenheimer, and then I want to say The Little Mermaid because I don't think. I think you need to pick three. Just oh, pick right. Barbie, Oppenheimer, and Super Mario. In that okay. order? Um. It might be Super Mario second. Oh, really? Yeah. I it did really well. You know well. what? Oh, yes. no, you were right. Yeah. Okay. All right, I'm out. So you guys handle Matt, the rest. Uh, Jen, I did see that because I was surprised. I was looking through the yeah. top box office grossing movies, and I was like, oh, it that made, surprised me. Yeah, Super Mario yeah. made April an amazing month. Oh, good. Okay. Uh, highest rated movies 2023 per letterbox. Okay. 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 Spider Man across, Spider -Man across the, the universe, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, Godzilla Minus One, the Godzilla Minus One, I don't remember that one. Yeah. The Iron Claw, Oppenheimer, and Poor Things. Did you remember that one? Ooh, so okay. I want to say Oppenheimer and Poor Things. Yeah. For but sure. then for the third, it could be Spider Man. Um, but there is a small but mighty crowd that loves Godzilla minus one. So I'm going to say Oppenheimer and four things, and then what do you guys think on the last one? I, would I lean... think I'm going to go Spider Man. I think I'm going to yeah. go Spider Man. Let's do it. It has a lot of pulling power. Woo! Spider Man, Oppenheimer, oh, Spider Man four number one. Okay. Even. Good. That's awesome. Job. Wow. Yeah, Gosh, yeah, rated yeah. movies. Okay. Now the highest paid actors of 2023. Tom Cruise, Adam Sandler, Pedro Pascal, Halle Berry, Margot Robbie, and Leonardo DiCaprio. I only know one for sure. Is it Pedro? Margot. Oh, Mar okay, so Margot. And I honestly, I was reading an article about how he's yes. just, he mm -hmm. is Netflix now. So he I is? think it's probably Adam Sandler. Okay, so Margot. Margot, Adam. Uh, I really wish it was Pedro. I don't think it is. I think, really? I, I feel like Tom trajectory. Cruise, Tom Cruise with the Mission Impossible, the way he's tied into that money, maybe Tom Cruise? And not, what did Leo like do? Incline, yeah, because you know, like he was so viral. Yeah. Like, okay, yeah, okay, do we want to go Tom Cruise, Margot, Adam, or Margot, Adam, Tom? Mm -hmm. you, Jen, you you make the final I, call. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. Tom Cruise. Yes. Adam Sandler. Nice. Margo. Wow. Adam Sandler. Yeah. Way to go, man. He is. What is he doing with all his money? I wonder. I. Making Buying more, more movies. basketball what is shorts. He doing? He's getting more than shorts. Basketball shorts, yeah. Okay. okay, top streamed movies 2023 per Nielsen. Moana, May, December, Encanto, Anatomy of a Fall, the Super Mario Brothers movie, The Beanie Bubble. <laughs> I really wish it was The Beanie Bubble. <laughs> that would be amazing. Well, um, I probably Super, Super Mario because mm -hmm. it's just. Um, and then I wouldn't I, be surprised if Anatomy of a Fall, but you, I want you guys to pick this one because I don't know. I don't know. Uh, this one got an Oscar, didn't it? Yeah. Okay. So, and I still want to see it. I um, but I feel like Moana and yeah. Encanto yeah. were brought up a lot. Right. Maybe even more so Encanto. I think Encanto. Because it was like okay. a cute family friendly. Yeah. Okay, so Encanto, I, I agree, Anatomy of a Fall and Super Mario. Okay. Is that, are you good I with really that? I really wish it was the Beanie Bubble, just for the record. And that's the one with Zach Galifianakis, right? I don't even know. Okay. okay, let's All right. see. All right, let's see. Mo Moana oh, Moana and Kondo. Yeah. That's what you said, Wait, right? can I ask a stupid question? Yeah. Is this Moana, like the original Moana, or is there a sequel? Or, yeah, I thought it was, came out a long time ago. It was the one, did it come out in like 2021? One. Yeah, I thought, I, Still, sorry, yeah. I thought it was an older movie. Yeah. Older than that, actually. Okay. Okay. Highest grossing movie so far of 2024, so far. Mm. Mean Girls, Challengers, Kung Fu Panda 4, Abigail, Godzilla, X Kong, The New Empire, and Dune Part D. Okay, <laughs> okay. 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 I um I wanna say Dune. Yep, I agree. Uh Kung Fu Panda. Mm -hmm. Huh. I, I agree. agree. And then maybe Mean Girls? I don't know. Well, nationwide what? or Abigail oh, worldwide. Maybe Godzilla and Kong. Uh, definitely Dune and Kung Fu, and then because Mean Girls had a lot more time than Challengers. Yes, to gross yeah. Mean more Girls money. came out, or if we're talking about the earliest, I guess we could say Mean Girls because it came out earlier. But I think Godzilla and Kong came out stronger. So, what do you think? I'm open. Okay. I I will go Godzilla on okay. this one, Dune and Kung Fu. Okay. There yeah. we go. Yeah. Way to go. Good job. Nice, very nice.
We did it. I, I don't feel pressured at all. Does anyone feel pressure? No, I, I, don't, I can breathe. And well, you took the did pressure really off well. Jen Ooh, Thanks. I thanks guess for I'm doing glad that. I read those reports. Right? Right? It finally paid off. Did it surprise you? Um, not really. I, I follow Letterboxd. If, if you love movies, you should be on Letterboxd because it's where you can review movies and talk about like what you want to see. And so you can have friends on there. It's like a social media for film lovers and really kind of see what's going on and what people recommend. So Letterboxd is the best. But I have to ask, did you see Challengers? I haven't yet because oh. it's a movie, like if my husband doesn't want to see it, that means I got to find time to go by myself. Yeah. Uh -huh. And I really want to see it. I've heard such good things. And the soundtrack yes. is yes. so good. Yes. It is so good. Yeah. Friends sent me a playlist. I was like, this is amazing. Yeah. yeah. And you know also this summer with the summer blockbusters, are there a lot of those superhero type movies? Not as many. Oh, good. Not as many. I think okay. we maybe already peaked. Over and we're, the... And we're yeah, down. so original films, please. Yeah. Like, that's, that's always my we do need wish, is that we can get back to a time when any kind of original film can make it and people can be excited about it. Like Mr. Mom. That was original. We need more Mr. Moms in this world. Seriously. Oh, that's I what love I'm that saying. Movie. Now, are you guys still doing the rewind? You know how you did like the 19, the, the capsule. 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 Yeah, we're still, capsules. we're in, um, getting ready to start 1984 soon. So I'm mm. very excited about that. But we've still got our 1989 menu and movies playing through this month. Okay. And a little oh, next good. month too. Perfect. So, oh gosh, there were so many great, I, I mean, I love 80s movies, I love 90s movies. Me too, me too. And so we've got 89 and 84, and then we go to 79 and 74 to finish out the year. So oh. the nines and the fours had it for this year, but I really hope we continue that series because it was fun. so many hidden gems or things you forgot and you're like, oh my gosh, like Troop Beverly Hills, Oh for gosh, love it. Phyllis yeah. Neffler. Yes. Love her and her okay. pants. Good. Well, make sure you check out everything fun and exciting happening at Alamo Draft House. Eat the great food and the new food. The, eat the great food and the drinks. Eat, so all the food. Yes. eat all the food. Eat all the food. Eat everything. Eat the pint glass. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. More fun on Ozark's Fox AM after this.